G'day guys, I'm just halfway through a shore dive today and I've been kicking for about two hours so I'm pretty knackered and thought it was a good chance to have a bit of a smoko. Um, today's shore dive is going pretty well, got a couple of nice snappers so far. This one was a, a point blank shot um, early morning. And then the second one, I've, um, I've spotted it from the surface and I sort of timed it and just waited for him to poke his head out and I, I plugged it. But anyway, um, today's episode is uh, episode two of Fishy Tales and it's about a giant boarfish that I shot about a year ago. So yeah, me and the mate, we took um, Jay's Haynes Hunter out. I needed a bit of a blast after sitting in the shed for a few weeks. And um, it was quite a windy day. So we were quite restricted on where we could dive. But I found a nice little sandy bay that was quite sheltered from the wind. And um, you anchored up in there in about five or six meters of water. We then decided to go snoop a bit of coast to try and get a, a snapper or two and there's quite a bit of current pushing down the coast which is um, quite a good sign for the snapper after a few misses um, i managed to plug a, a nice snapper from quite a deep gut And I didn't realize, but as I was fighting the fish, I got pulled out of the, the, the coast and sort of taken out to the weed line. So as I was um, yeah, fighting the fish out on the weed line, I thought it looked quite good for a uh, boar fish. But I was a bit scared to dive out there, just given the amount of boats going past and, and you know, hooligans at that time of year. Um, I did have a float, but yeah, you never know, people often come quite close to shore. So I had the great idea of swimming back to the, the boat and grabbing the anchor and then swimming the, the, the boat out to the wee line so I could dive around the boat. Um, I don't know why I didn't think of just getting in the boat and, and driving it out but yeah, it's a different story. Um, when I got back to the anchor, I looked down and there was this really big boarfish just sitting right on the anchor, like on the, on the chain. And we're talking like five or six metres of water so I was quite... I'm um, quite surprised to see it there. The hardest part about boar fish is just finding the things. So once you actually find one, um, you're more than likely to get pretty close to it and put a spear into it. Uh, this one kind of knew something was up. And as I started to approach it, it started to tail off. Uh, but I managed to yeah, put a nice little uh, shot into it. And it was a decent sized one. It was probably up around that six kilo mark, which is um, quite, a, yeah, quite a good sized boar fish. And the bro also managed a, a couple of boarfish as well, which was really cool to see. It was um, his first ones ever, so he was stoked as. That's today's episode, just something a bit different. Um, wasn't the most uh, amazing fish, but I quite like the story behind it and, um, and the bit of footage as well was pretty cool. So yeah, thanks for tuning in and um, yeah, we'll catch you in the next one.